Hi ladies, how are you? Gentlemen, you can stay. You can totally stay. This is not just for women, but I only have experience with women, so oh, that came out wrong. I only have experience on this topic with women, so it's, you know, that's the vantage point I'm gonna be taking in this conversation. Listen, listen, people. How many of you, and I want you to be honest, okay? How many of you, when you go into a public washroom, sit down on the toilet seat, you fall out, put your upper thighs, and you know, your little bum, you sit them down on a bare toilet seat. Now come on, be honest. Do you do that? Do you? How about you? And you, do you do that? Have you ever done that? Now I wanna tell you something, okay? I observe people using a public washroom fairly frequently because I'm in public fairly frequently. So I have observed multiple, multiple women walking into a public washroom, a ladies washroom, running into the washroom, into the stall, and you can hear them sitting down on the toilet seat. Boop. Toilet seat makes a little sound. You know, when you sit on it, it kind of adjusts itself. The plastic kind of moves, you know. Boop. They did not put anything down. These washrooms that I'm observing this in have toilet seat liner dispensers. It's right on the wall as soon as you walk in. It even says, line the toilet seat. You know, it's got this nice curved sign here, you know, line the toilet seat. When you, clo when you close the stall door, someone has made a sign and put it, stuck it onto all of the doors. Be courteous. Please line the toilet seat when you use it. Ladies, I think about 80% of you, you run in and you just, you just sit down. Now, I know, I think I read somewhere there's been studies done that say that, you know, it, it's fine. It doesn't hurt you. The bacteria is not really there. It doesn't live very long, all of this. Okay, fine. If that's the case, fine. But my question to you still is, would you run up to a stranger Pull your pants down, turn around, and have them turn around at the same thing, do exactly the same thing, and then, you know, like, kind of nuzzle up your, you know, your upper thighs up against this person, and, you know, your bum. Would you, like, hey, girl, how you doing? Nice to meet you. You wouldn't. You wouldn't. So now, why would you go into a bathroom stall and put your bare skin on a toilet seat? Someone could have just been there two seconds ago, and a lot of the time, someone was. How do you know they didn't pee on the toilet seat and just wipe it off? And it looks dry, it looks clean, but it's not. It's really just smeared pee all over it. It just kind of dried before you got there. Why? Why? Why don't you just put a little bit of toilet paper down or get those toilet seat, you know, the liners, you know, they got the little, it's like a big donut, you know, got the little hole in it. You just punch out the little hole, throw it in the toilet, put the toilet seat liner down. Why? That's all I wanted to say today. Thank you very much for coming back. And you know what? If you haven't already, please feel free to like this video. And I'd really love it if you would subscribe. As I've mentioned multiple times in previous videos, I don't really know where this channel is going, but I think I'm just going to start talking. I'm just going to talk, talk about how I feel, talk about current subjects, talk about whatever, take you on some, you know, little adventures that I have. And, you know, come along with me if you like you're more than welcome to hit the subscribe button below. And if you haven't already as well, there is a bell icon down there. Feel free to click it because that means you'll be notified each time I make a new video. <sighs> line your toilet seat, ladies. And gentlemen, feel free to line those toilet seats too. Don't sit your bare bomb down on a toilet seat, okay? That's all I have to say today. That's all. That is all. Have a great day. <laughs> I'll talk to you later. Bye.